Hi, welcome to Thumbs Up South Florida. We've got Barbara Smith, and then we also have Diane Ziegler. So welcome ladies, thank you so much for coming and being a part of this. It's a pleasure to have you. you. Um, it, there's something really quite unique about your particular type of baking. Look at this. I mean, this looks absolutely delicious. And uh, I'm drooling at this moment. <laughs> drooling. So tell me, tell me what got you started in this? Growing up, both my parents came from uh, Europe and uh, the kitchen was a very special place. I would sit with my mother and help her cook and bake and um, I loved it. Aww. It was it was my passion. That sounds wonderful. I'm a wholesale baker. Okay. And, okay. And um, I uh, bake gluten free, glu ah. gluten free vegan and vegan. And um, what no, I these things cannot be gluten free and vegan. Are you uh, kidding? Some right. But I don't think gluten-free was a big thing then. No, no. <laughs> I have a daughter, and when she started uh, elementary school, it was my, my passion that she would learn to eat healthy. Ah. And I feel it's very important for children to learn when they're younger because that will trickle up into adulthood, uh, healthy eating. Ah. So I would go into her classroom and uh, teach the kids how to cook and eat healthy as far as uh, making shish kebabs out of uh, vegetables and fruit and talk about the color and the health benefits and it just looked very pretty and they loved it and they got to play with the food and use their hands. I love that. That and is so important. Exactly. And um, soon after I decided to uh, teach children how to cook and eat healthy. Isn't that amazing? Because. You know, um, I can see why the marriage between you two is so important. Your restaurant. Right. So a lot of the people that come uh, to us, uh, first of all, they just want tasty food. So that's, that's the first thing. Mm -hmm. So when they walk in, the food is wholesome, it's delicious, and it's also nutritious. But a lot of the people that come in have some specialty diets. So perhaps that they're looking at a gluten-free um, program or because for their own health, or they're for a certain diet, paleo, keto, um, it used to be like an Atkins, like uh, carb free. Mm -hmm. So um, when Diane came to us and she had all these gourmet desserts and many of them fit the profile of the customers that we were uh, also uh, meeting their needs, uh, it seemed like a perfect marriage. So share with us, tell us a little bit about your desserts. Okay, to my left are the uh, gluten-free coconut macaroons. Oh. Uh, they come in many flavors. I was also featured in the Miami Herald for them. Really? So I was very thrilled about that. So that has come basically as my signature cookie. Ah. And um, Barbara loved the idea of me starting to top them off with chocolate. So <laughs> that any, anything with chocolate. Anything right. with chocolate, yeah. yeah. So I have that problem too. <laughs> exactly. So we started to do uh, that here at the kitchen and people just love them. Mm -hmm. uh, they come in vanilla, they come in chocolate chip, organic cacao, cookies and cream, and I just am launching Kahlua. Oh wow, love it, love it. I, I love Kahlua anyhow, I like that coffee flavor. Excellent. So and tell us a little bit about um, this beautiful array of desserts. Okay, so we have a little bit of everything here, a little potpourri if you will. This is a paleo chocolate coconut bread. It doesn't contain, and it's important to know I am uh, non-GMO. So everything I do wow. is on the healthy side, of course. So I if I don't, I never use a processed sugar. Uh, if I have to use sugar in a recipe, it's always organic, but it's also very little. Mm. Uh, this particular piece uh, is made with organic maple syrup, so that's the sweetener. Wow. And it is dairy free. Uh, right in the center are actually little mini bites that do very well in the kitchen. Uh, they're yeah, actually they ever come out of the kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> yes, unfortunately. <laughs> they're actually made with uh, pumpkin and avocado as really? their base. So oh my yes, gosh. and uh, vegan chocolate chips and uh, organic cocoa. So again, they're dairy free. 
This is a gluten-free vegan chocolate chip cookie. Uh, then we have over here the uh, raspberry and triple berry fruit bars, gluten-free and vegan. Which we just wow. shared one off camera and everybody was saying, oh my God. <laughs> Did you really? I'm so jealous. I can't wait. It's delicious. Oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> and this is a new product, a gluten-free vegan blondie. And it's made actually with a cashew butter. So it's very oh. healthy. And again, dairy free. Um, over to the far end here is a, another paleo banana bread that doesn't have any sweetener at all. So I let the banana and the coconut be the marriage. Mm -hmm. And then next to there is the uh, uh, brownie. And you sell a lot of those too mm -hmm. here. Um, it is sugarless and it's oh. flourless. So, and it also has walnuts. So I let the chocolate be the sugar, uh, oh. the sweetener. And um, and that really is what's on this platter. That powder. is absolutely incredible. Tell me about your mom. She was a phenomenal cook. Um, everything she did looked like a picture. Oh. Um, I can tell you miss her, but she's with you. Yes. I mean, you've carried that heritage, that lineage, yes. all the way down, because your daughter's doing this now, right? Exactly. Oh, is that beautiful? Yes. That is beautiful. And for sharing your food. Yeah, and it's delicious. You won't be disappointed. <laughs> oh, no, I'm sure I won't be. <laughs> I can't wait. So thank you again, thank ladies, you. for being a part of our show. And um, listen, I've got to tell you, you've got to get over here. You have to try this food. It is absolutely stunning, amazing. Just give them a call. Sidewalk Chef Kitchen, 954-488-2554. Excellent. Okay, thank you so much, thank ladies. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thumbs up, South Florida.